Hi guys, today I will teach you everything you need to know about structures. So let's start with the gate towers. The towers have 3000 health, 20 ammo and deal 100 damage. The back tower deal 50% more damage. Ammo is reloaded every 15 seconds. The gate has 3700 health. The walls have 1350 health, give vision and block some abilities like Nova's triple tap. Since the walls have lower health than the gate, it's smarter to destroy those instead of the gate if you got overpowered by Diablo. The healing well has 1750 health. By using the healing well it heals 45% of your health and restores 33% of your mana over 20 seconds. Forts have 9000 health, 40 ammo and deal 150 damage. Their attacks slow your movement and attack speed by 40%, so it's not very smart to tank them, especially as the Dragon Knight. Let's continue with the buildings on the keep. I will compare their stats with the buildings at the fort. The keep towers have 43% more health, they deal 50% more damage, but the back tower only deals 33% more damage. The gate has 35% more health and the walls have 40% more health. The healing well only have 14% more health. The keep has 44% more health than the fort and deals 33% more damage. Destroying the keep and the fort in one lane will cause this lane to spawn catapults each wave. The core has 21,000 health, a 14,000 shield, which scale every minute until minute 20. Since the scaling stops at 20 minutes, you can almost always finish the game if you take down all enemies and all of your teammates are alive past the 20 minute mark. The attacks from the core splash for 100% of the damage in a small radius, so the player tanking the core should move a little bit away from the team. Thanks so much for watching. Next episode I will try to find the best graphics settings for competitive play. So hit the subscribe button if you don't want to miss out.